This isn't the same city you saw last time you visited, kid. Nivalis is changing in front of our eyes. This is a bolder city, a brighter city. More people to meet, more things to do. More electric night. Last time you were here, this was all a dream. Your old pal Thaddeus is retiring. You can have my old life. It doesn't fit me anymore. I'm leaving you a tasty little business venture. A noodle stand. Work hard and maybe one day you'll climb so high, you'll be above the rain. There's more to this city than business. Follow the rules, or break them all. Grow your own paradise in the greenhouses. Sail a boat out and cast your line into the forbidden seas. You might find more than fish. I've heard the rumors. A serial killer? Don't worry too much. I'm sure you're safe. My time is up, kid. Now get out there. The city is waiting. Welcome back to Indie Wave Makers. We are live at Taipei Game Show, and here we are at the last game of today's session, but certainly not the least. Just by watching the trailer, I have already been absorbed and attracted by the cyberpunk world and can wait to know more about that. And this game that we are showcasing last for today is called The Valleys. And to showcase that here with me, I have Marco from Iron Lands to join me and to talk more about this amazing game. So, Marco, hi, how are you? Hi, Maggie. I'm hi. Hi, thank you. you. It's so glad to have you joining <laughs> us. So, first of all, can you start by introducing yourself, your role uh, in Islands, and also a little bit about what you have been doing in the Islands? Yeah, so uh, I'm, I'm Marco. I'm the creative director at Islands. Mm -hmm. uh, we have been, uh, like, our last game is called Cloudpunk. Cloudpunk so, yeah. some players might know that. Yeah. So, this uh, game, Nivalis, is based on the same city okay. that, that we introduced in Cloudpunk. Mm -hmm. It's a huge, it's a vast uh, cyberpunk city and yeah. it's realized in a so-called voxel art style. Mm -hmm. So we, uh, we are using many, many or billions little blocks okay. to make all the assets. Okay. And that creates a sort of 3D pixel art style. Yeah, it certainly which, looks amazing. Yeah, it's very... Um, yeah, no, I don't know. Um, special. Yeah, it is. Like you can see, like lots of elements inside. Actually, like I, for now, I can see Korean. I can see J-pop. I can see <laughs> like all kinds of elements inside, and like flying spacecrafts, everything. So, what is the story behind the valleys? What is this town about? Yeah, so the city has actually uh, been for thousands of years. Thousands nobody, of years. And nobody knows how long it exists, and we also don't want to give any real uh, reference yeah, of yeah, yeah. Uh, where it is or when it is. Um, yeah, it's, uh, it's a city that has a lot of problems. Problems it's, uh, such as? It's falling apart in, in style. Mm -hmm. The entire uh, planet is flooded. The city mm -hmm. is flooded. Mm -hmm. So um, the boat will play an important role later on. We can show that. Okay. Like uh, literally falling apart? Yeah, I mean, yeah. in Cloudpunk we already introduced that uh, concept. I mean, it's a city controlled in part by AI and also CorpSec. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, CorpSec stands for Corporate Security. Corporate Security, yeah. So everything in the city is based on economy and, and, and like uh, corporate interest. Ah. And if the corporate interest is not, you know, supported mm -hmm. by anyone, they will be shut down. Ah, true. So, uh, like everything that you have to do, so it's very uh, a cyberpunk topic, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Um, so everything that you have to do has to create some sort of money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like value, profit. I guess that's what we as gamers <laughs> need to do in the game. Yeah. yeah. What, okay, so let's get started. So it's a little bit more relaxed, yeah, in yeah, for okay. the player. Let's let's just start and uh, yes. while it loads. Yeah, it's a little. It's a little bit more relaxed for us. We mm -hmm. are inheriting a noodle bar mm -hmm. from a guy called uh, Thaddeus, and then we have to manage it. We can also um, decorate and own multiple apartments. Okay. And that's a very part of the process. Here we can, you can, uh, can see the the apartment we are waking up. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. a decent apartment, I like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So it's not a ramshackle hut. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, um, 
Yeah, so we uh, see everything from first-person perspective. Yes. That's a very deliberate uh, um, uh, um, yeah, choice. Mm -hmm. And so we are uh, talking right now to Ava. She's our personal companion, digital companion. Okay. Very nice, always helpful, never really uh, complains Aww, about sweet. you. <laughs> so mm -hmm. it's uh, like a real buddy. Okay. And, and uh, yeah, she is guiding us basically also through, through the beginning of the game. Mm -hmm. We have to find Thaddeus. Okay. But yeah, we can look around on our partner and we can can interact with it, yeah. open the window, uh, we have a bathroom and, and everything. We can decorate whatever nice. we want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And also, like, when you play the demo, here's more stuff that you can decorate, but I, it might go a, l uh, yeah, a little too deep right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can even go outside the balcony and take a look around. Wow, the, the whole world is like a com built in a very complete and detailed and way. It's yeah. very beautiful. So let's go outside and yes. take a look around. Let's go. So we can talk to various NPCs standing uh -huh. around who... Oh, I, mean, I like her outfit! <laughs> the, 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 the one that just passed by. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so here's uh, one guy we can talk to, yeah. but they are not just standing around, uh, as I was saying. Uh, they all have their own lives. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, we'll take part of them. So you get to interact with them. Yeah, so we have a lot of, they have a lot of side stories. So story is a very, very important aspect. Oh. There are four main story pillars. Uh huh. And uh, we will they will kind of like inter like you know mingle with each other yeah, the, to create right. one big story. Right, 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 right. But there are also several side stories of all the characters that we meet. Mm -hmm. And yeah, so here we can see traveling through the city. It's wow, amazing! It's the best space. Yeah. And now we find our noodle bar, and there we have to set up everything mm -hmm. so that we can get customers, right? Yes. So to to earn money <laughs> and to earn money, make start your happy. business. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we don't earn a lot of money. It's uh, it's part of the game, of course, but there's many many aspects of it. Mm -hmm. And uh, the most important aspect, I think, for us is to be immersed in this space. Yes, I to see. To take time to look around yeah, and definitely. there's nobody to shoot at. Um, you know, there's no competitive... You can totally relax and explore A little everything. bit, yeah. yeah. I mean, there's of course certain economy, uh, like uh, rivals uh -huh. who have their own place, but you know, okay, so here's uh, Thaddeus. Okay. He's leaving us. So what you can see here is the relationship matrix. Yeah. Um, we Romance, can, yeah, enemy. we can develop uh, character relationships throughout mm -hmm. the game, okay. and they can develop in in certain like axes. Yeah. So either it goes in the friend role mm -hmm. or the romance. Yeah. And then business, business and, and enemy. enemy. It's very yeah. small here. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, so uh, depending on how we choose to uh, talk to someone, uh -huh. they they cannot like what we are saying and uh, it affects get a little axis. angry, right? Yeah. So Thaddeus is pretty pretty okay with everything. Mm -hmm. Like after all, uh, he's inheriting his noodle bar to us. That's his. Uh, ah, that's the place. So now you have the noodle bar. Yeah. Now we have the noodle bar, and now we have to set it up. We have to uh, place tables. place tables, mm -hmm. so we can place them here in this uh, blue marked area. Mm -hmm. And now the chairs. So the chairs have to be, of course, by the table. That's yes. indicated here. We can rotate them around, mm -hmm. um, but they are marked green when they are like ready to be placed correctly. Yes. So this is how we ah. make sure that customers can actually sit down. Yes. So Ava is guiding us again through through the process. Mm -hmm. We have to put something on the menu mm -hmm. so that customers will come and order something. Yes. So let's put the first two Beef on the ramen. menu. Yeah. Fish burger. Oh, uh, let's do this instead, I think. What's that? Otake nigiri. Otake nigiri. What yeah. is it? That's a sushi. Sushi. Ah. Sushi is always good, right? Yes. No, nobody so, hates it. So now we are ready to talk to our chef. Okay. Yeah. Banner. Banner. So here you can see he is like a friend. Yeah. But <laughs> uh, depending on how we talk to him, this can actually turn we can get to work. quite quickly. I'm curious and want to find out. Yeah, you see? How you yeah. That was a quite a because sarcastic remark, yeah, you know? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> and now he's neutral. Yes. And you, now you better say something good to him. And now let's let's say something more <laughs> sarcastic to him and then 
it goes the oh other way. Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah, I don't know. It's just you showing. You meet him, right? Yeah, I just chose the choices here, and yeah, then yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. that's. But you can, you can like uh, buy. You can totally fix it. Yeah, yeah. You know, I mean, he's a, he's a very nice guy, and, uh -huh. and he would not want to be not <laughs> want to be enemy with right, him, right, 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 right? And he's after all, he's serving your customers. Yes. Not really in your interest. Yes. Yeah. So at this point, um, the customers will come. Okay. And I think he is already someone coming and sitting Ready down to serve the food. Exactly. Yeah. So we can see what. She's ah, doing, so she's, she's, waiting. she's waiting for order, and yes. then Banner will come and serve him. But in the meantime, we can also explore other stuff. Okay. For example, here we have two new quests, uh, which introduce us to fishing, okay. uh, boat driving, and uh, farming. Ah. farming. Farming is done in greenhouses. So, so, so Brenner will run the noodle shop for you, and he will run it. We don't have to do anything. We okay. can, we can interfere. We can have to. Uh, we have to manage ingredients. Mm -hmm. Make sure that he has everything that he needs to to, to make to, the dishes. To operate. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, we can also. I mean, depending on the recipes and on the uh, what we put on the menu, we have to have certain equipment in the kitchen. Ah. So right. uh, th that way we can uh, later on expand our menu, make mm -hmm. everything more interesting. Okay. Uh, through the various actions in the game, uh, talking to people and exploring like new areas, mm -hmm. we get so-called um, like uh, what are they called uh, points that um, that unlock new recipes. Ah, okay, just like like experience. Yeah. Like experience points, but. Uh, I just forgot the name. <laughs> <laughs> um, <clears throat> yeah, this way we we can unlock new stuff and and so there's now pro you're going a progression. Fishing? Yeah, I'm going to the docks area here. It's it's by the by the ocean. Okay. Uh, as you can see, there's like wow, I like stuff the there. harbor. Yeah, it's a cozy little harbor, and here's a a guy oh called Carol <laughs> Crabface Jones. <laughs> He um, he will introduce us to the boat. He okay. will uh, uh, let us use his boat, and okay. then we can actually use it and and uh, go around. Okay. I can quickly show can that. Can we actually like drive it and leave yeah, the harbor? Yeah, yeah. We can sh we can go inside here. Wow. And actually that's a go cozy booth. go on that platform here, and yeah, then actually with the same it. movement that that we use for walking, we can go around the boat. Oh, that's nice. What we can even do, we can stop the engine here. Okay. And now we are like fully moving again. Ah, it's like an automatic driving. Yeah, no, no, no it's a stop now. Oh, you stop it. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And uh, then, yeah, we can look around mm -hmm. and we can take out our fishing pole. Okay. Fishing rod. Ah, fishing rod. Yeah. Whoop. And uh, so this little scanner that you see on the side is a fish scanner. Ah, you will it, see it where... It will show us, um, you know, where fish are. But we can already see them there in the water. Yeah, like the, the light green yeah, shadows. Yeah, they are a little bit lit. And at some point they will come. And oh, there we fish. go. Oh, and then you get your That's fish. That's our first, first fish. Mm. So do you want to take it or, or leave it, the bream? Oh, uh, why not take it? Yeah, let's yeah. take it. <laughs> So we can use this fish, of course, in our restaurant. Uh huh. Right. Is there a certain times that you can use your rods? Limit, limitless, or? It's limitless, but mm -hmm. the fish are not always there. Ah, right. And we have also uh, times and areas where fish will appear. Oh, okay. So not every time, and this will. This is also how we can equip, uh, how we can uh, progress and and um, unlock new fish type. Mm. Like very rare fish, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So here we, uh, if we go the to the rings, we can yeah. dock again. Okay. And then it uh, docks it for us. We don't have to do that. Yeah. It's a little bit cumbersome. Yeah. So that's the boat driving. Okay. And now, if we have still time, we can show see the farming. See the greenhouse. Yes. Yeah. I would like to see that. Yeah. yeah so this area, we can go everywhere here. We we can go upstairs here and mm -hmm. and have a nice overview. Oh, it'll, that's nice. It'll take some time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. So yeah, basically, everything I see, I can enter. No, no, not everything, but many things. Many things. Uh, here yeah. is a store. Like as long as you can make it inside. Yeah, you as can long as we it. have uh, built the interior. Here yeah, is someone yeah, yeah. who can sell you stuff. Mm. Um, we also here we actually have a second apartment that we can buy. Okay. Yeah. So this I can I can quickly show. How much can, is it? I can start renting it. It's cheap right now. Ah, <laughs> you can rent it. Yeah. Yeah. And now I can. So this is a duplex. Okay. 
has a second floor. Oh, it's nice. Yeah, and then we can decorate it as it's we like want. A, a little bit like an industrial Japanese yeah. kind of style. Yeah, it has a nice view. Yes. I like the other more, but whoever, you know, if, if you like duplexes more, then why you can not? Rank. Yeah, that's right. But yeah, let's go to the, the greenhouse. greenhouse. Yeah. Yes. So we have to talk to someone first, but I can quickly go. Okay. Of course, you would take your time. I'm, yeah, I'm rushing course. through yeah, right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because right? you want to show me everything. Yeah, here's yeah. another thing that you can enter, and then there will be other venues. Here, this will be a bar. Okay. And there will be many more places. So actually, let me show you the mini map. Wow. Uh, it's actually, I, I don't know why you say mini map. It's actually not that mini. It's not mini at all. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's huge. Like, it's fast. Yeah, so There's this like is actually so many places you can go. This is actually showing only half the places that we have already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And this is not discovered yet. So yeah. all the areas you can uh, uh, discover by either talking to NPCs or yeah, doing, yeah, yeah. doing quests. I really so like like how you picture uh, presented it in a, like a, a little bit like a pixel art kind of yeah, style. Yeah, we wanted it to show it like in two D. Uh, usually you see it from uh, from top down, but right. there you there you cannot do a lot of things right, visually. Right, right, right. But here uh, we have a new version of it where right. we we can see some some shades down here, some uh, some characters, yeah. boats, and everything. I really like that. Yeah. So the greenhouses are these things. Oh wow! Cool. And I don't know, maybe we don't even have to talk. Yeah, we can do it without talking to her because it might take too long. Okay. So I can rent it the same way as I rent apartments. Yeah. And then you can use it. So this is the greenhouse. It's a greenhouse. It's already equipped for you in this demo. Yeah, it's, it's like a lab. There are multiple uh, units. Here okay. you can do like garlic. And it's also for uh, for for herbs kind of okay. thing. Okay. And these are the like where you grow the ingredients for yeah. your restaurant. Yeah, you can either use them for your restaurant or you can sell them. Ah. Right here is a cool thing called the meat printing. Meat printing, printing module. It's actually three D printing meat. Oh my god. Yeah, you can see that. It actually is what will be happening in the future. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So That's I think cool. it's already happening right now. I think I heard a story that yeah, there's yeah, stuff yeah. like that. Yeah, it's just a, 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 a mushroom effect that whether you dare to try it or not. Yeah. So a different units that you can equip and then uh, you can also move them around mm -hmm. and and uh, you know make best use of your greenhouse. Yeah. And uh, you also have to farm. Uh, you have to harvest the stuff when it's done. Ah, right. right. So you here, can't just leave that there. here, I mean, you will get informed. Okay. Uh, we are notification, but here you can see the progress. Oh. How they are doing. They grow super fast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't. Ah, uh, here's a scroll wheel. Yeah. So the growth oh. is quite quite quick now, okay. uh, so that we can see some progress. But it's also a kind of. You can, you can maximize it by uh, doing like a. a Temperature rock control. Yeah, it's like a rock, paper, scissor kind of gameplay thing. Uh huh. Uh, you have to manage uh, whether the temperature is high, humidity or light. Yeah. No thing. You cannot just maximize everything yeah, yeah, and yeah, then yeah, yeah. it's like perfect for every plant. Yeah. Every plant has different needs. Ah, but how can and you tell which are the... It like will the be told uh, okay, to you. Okay. You can play around with it and then in the modules here you can see ah. the harvest yield. And okay. Right. And if that is only like... Um, like uh, not maximized, then you know you can still optimize it. Mm. Yeah. So you might do one greenhouse specialized in doing grapes, yeah. and the other meat printing and yeah, mushrooms yeah, yeah. or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. So that can be, and you can also buy upgrades to make things faster. Ah. So yeah, there are you earn like more money of and so on. To do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So let's maybe go back um, to our apartment. Okay. Uh, we have we have this new apartment now. We have to go back here. Okay. And whenever you go to sleep, yeah. the next day starts and you okay. see the newspaper okay. uh, with actual news that you can influence with your choices. Oh. So depending on what you do with the characters and how you, uh, yeah, how you affect the world, mm -hmm. it can, can change it. And of course, there's a, as mentioned in the trailer, there's a big danger right now. Yes. We are all in the localized unity zone because there's a serial killer roaming around. I saw that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so that course, is something you also need to deal with? Um, 
I will not spoil too much, okay, no but spoilers, it, yeah. it will, you will completely be safe, you know? Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so, but yeah, you can... But it's part of the game, yeah. I hope it works here yeah, in the second apartment, I haven't tested it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you go ah, to sleep. so now it's when you go to sleep. Yeah, okay. now you go to sleep and you, you end the day, mm -hmm. your restaurant will still run. Yeah. Uh, depending on how you set up the staff, mm -hmm. at which hours they are. So that can all be managed. Okay. Okay. And then the next day comes. Next day comes and we see the newspaper. There we go. The Nivalis Times shows okay. news for us. Lockdown or lock up. And here we can see the weather Should forecast. Yeah. That will also play an important role. Because okay. we uh, recently developed snow. Mm -hmm. Snow, yeah. yeah and that, ah, that's so nice. that's not in this build yet, but mm -hmm. it, it will be making things a lot more interesting. Okay. Who wants to sit outside and eat in the snow? I don't know. Yeah. Not many. <laughs> so you have to Chinese make people want? We do. <laughs> <laughs> snow is like super rare for us. We do oh, want to. Yeah, okay. <laughs> maybe only once. Yeah, maybe only once. Then you all get sick <laughs> because <laughs> <laughs> you sat down for two hours in the cold. Yeah, but it's worth it. It's worth it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so oh, it gets it's raining today. It's raining. Yeah, yeah actually yeah. raining a lot. Yeah, it's like pour pouring. Yeah, it's pouring. Yeah. So what would you say set this game apart from the others, and what would be like the feature that you will feel most excited about this game? I think. Um, so, I mean, there are many simulations out there and also some life sims. Yeah. But our focus on combining a deep story mm -hmm. with a life sim and uh, complex interactions with character, I think, sets it apart. Yes. And, I mean, besides the style. Yeah, 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 yeah. The style is also, like, very unique. And also, like, uh, uh, what kind of gamers would you think would be interested in this game? Everyone who Every likes cyberpunk mm -hmm. uh, genre. Uh, and everyone who who uh, likes to sit uh, uh, play relaxed games. Mm -hmm. yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, yes, there's some some danger here, but but overall, it's a relaxed and cozy experience that focuses on the atmosphere. Yeah, I and see. And like being at home in this world. Mm -hmm. And when can we expect this game to be released? Yeah, sometime so this year. This year. Yeah. Okay, this year. So uh, for now. Uh, Maybe you do have like an early access version already out? No, we Not don't yet. do early access, no. Uh, okay. we, uh, we are following the principle that uh, the game needs as much time as it needs yes, to, and course. then we release it in full. But somewhere this year? We hope so. We yes. hope so. Okay. <laughs> so uh, for the, the people who are watching, who are interested in knowing more about this game, when it will be released, where can they find you? Uh, we um, we are on Steam yeah, right Steam. now. Mm -hmm. um, we will uh, launch first on Steam and the Epic uh, Game Store, mm -hmm. and we'll consider uh, like uh, porting it to other platforms later. Okay. And what about social media platforms that uh, oh, yeah. where you upload your uh, upgrades uh, or updates that people can know? Yeah, you can find us on Twitter at Ironlands. You can find us on Facebook, mm -hmm. uh, on TikTok. On, Even on Instagram, yeah, okay. all of them. All of them. <laughs> okay, so just type I on lens and know more about this game. And just, uh, I really enjoy this time. And the session has nearly come to an end. But thank you so much for sharing this game with me. I really had a great time to be immersed in this cyberpunk world and really thank want you, to Megan. know more about that. I really want to explore more in the buildings, to talk more with all the NPCs. I'm sure it will be like a super fantastic journey. And I hope to see it uh, nearly in the future this year. Hope so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so thank you so much for. Thank for sharing this game with me. Thank you. It was my pleasure. Thank you. Okay, so this brings us to the end of today's session, but tomorrow we have more to come, more interesting and innovative indie games we will be bringing you live here in Taipei Game Show. So uh, until then, I'll see you tomorrow. We'll be back.